The National Coalition Against Domestic Violence, on average, nearly 20 people per minute are physically abused by an intimate partner here in the U.S. A local woman is pulling back the curtain on her own abuse, hoping to prevent others from going through what she endured. Here's my Today's Women Report. In her book, The Mask Behind the Mask, Shana Gordine's goal is for those who've experienced domestic violence to examine the many masks they've had to wear as they've tried to survive the ordeals they faced. In her new companion piece of film called Through Their Eyes, The Mask Behind the Mask, she goes even deeper and allows victims to do something many may not have done become transparent about what happened to them at the hands of their abuser. Even Gordine doesn't shrink back from the details. I was choked and they was literally choking me up. I was fighting, I was fighting. The idea for the film, she says, began when she heard that the numbers of abuse victims were going up during this pandemic. It was aimed to show the perpetrators the fact that that is not just targeting just the person that you're harming, you're harming the kids, the family, and extended people as well. Her young daughter is proof that domestic violence hurts more than the victim. In the film, she says she saw her mom being abused, but she just didn't know how to help. I wanted to say something, but I didn't know what to do because I wanted to say something, but I didn't know what's going to happen. If I... Although domestic violence victims may have felt afraid to share their stories in the past, Gerdine says that's changing. She used social media to find participants, and she got an immediate response. We um, connected as far as putting a post on Facebook and asking people if they're comfortable enough to tell their story. And many of them did. If you would like to see the video, just go to our website. That's WNYT.com. We have set up a link.